Half a gallon, I'm the man. If you broke, you just wouldn't under. All right, first and foremost, real quick. I'm doing my very first Slick Talk Cypher. July 2nd, start at 2 p.m. Uh, it's open to the public. Um, it's no tickets at, uh, um, like, on Eventbrite and all that. 25 at the door. It's going to be hookah. It's going to be liquor. Might have some food there. And we're going to rap. We're going to get crazy. It's going to be a dope event. Uh, if y'all want to pull up, y'all can pull up. Come pop out. I just wanted to get that out the way. Um, Like I said before, I'm not a blogger. Right? And I saw somebody say, oh, but you ain't a blogger, but you're blogging. How are you not a blogger? So because I'm talking on something or blogging, that means I'm a blogger. I, I, I don't know. I, th I think a lot of y'all need a uh, high school um, diplomas, for real. I, I think a lot of y'all need to, to learn. But, yo, why would you? My fault, y'all. I'm driving. I just came from the gym. My fault. This little... Honda Civic Yo listen Let, let me tell y'all something Y'all little dudes Little Spanish dudes That be getting these Honda Civics uh, and, and, and and putting them low Them little mufflers on them And it sound like Two cans rattling And then you hooking it up And making it low And it dropping And the wheels come out like this And it look bow legged Throw those away Please Y'all get me tight With those little Dumb cars My fault Just had a, just had a breakdown But we good We back Alright so anyway I know I be late on a bunch of things. I'm sorry. I be late on a bunch of things because I'm not in my phone all day. So I be late on a bunch of things. Whatever I see is because either somebody sent it to me or the bloggers are posted and I'll see it like that. Right? So in this case, somebody sent it to me and I saw the bloggers posted. But it was something I wanted to come talk about and share. Just my point of view on things. And you know, y'all tell me if y'all if y'all feel the same way or if y'all don't. That's it. Um, so I saw uh, something with Easy uh, post something on. I think he posted something on Twitter and he said something about. He said added Papoose and said um, Papoose clear this up, or I'm gonna have to clear it up or something like that of that nature. I think that's a smart move for him. I think it would have been even smarter if he would have did it in the beginning when it happened. But I think, you know what I'm saying? I think it's a smart move only for this reason. It would have been smarter if he did it in the beginning because it's been six days now. And it's like, all right, you know, you're saying it now. But it makes me think like, are right, you saying it now because we all we all see Papoose is not going to respond. Papoose ain't say nothing, and I don't think he's going to say nothing. That's the right thing to do. If something is true, he doesn't have to say nothing. You know what I'm saying? If you know something is true, you don't got to say nothing about nothing. That's one, right? If you know something is true. Um, also, like, if, it, it, it's, it's only right that Remy come out and say nothing happened. You know what I'm saying? It's only right that Easy say nothing happened. Just like it's only right if Papoose don't say nothing at all, right? But the way I'm looking at it is... That's a smart that's the smart way or smart thing to do because at this point we kind of know Papoose ain't gonna say anything. So if you say that and he don't say nothing, you know it could look like, oh, maybe that didn't happen. You get what I'm saying? So I think it's a smart move. Not saying we know what happened, because something could have not have happened. But Whatever, if it did or if it didn't, that's a smart move to play because it, it, it can make it look like, yo, listen, ain't nothing happening. and you letting this rock. Do you need me to? What I think with, with anything that goes on in life, right, you don't need action or to actually see something to know if something is real or not or to... Know where the story goes Right Me saying that is saying You should be able to read between the lines I'm very good at reading between the lines I pay attention to the situation I look at things That's happening And I could I, I could pretty much know what happened Or what didn't happen Let's say that So in this situation In this situation We, we all know it's been, it been a while It's been six days since that um, You know 
we used to a person going on live and going on YouTube all the time when something happened to address something and that didn't happen. So if you look at the whole situation and you just read between the lines, you should already know in your head. At this point, I don't ever feel like easy need to go on live. I feel like, you know, you should have your answer already if you believe it or not. You know, it's been too long at this point, so I don't feel like he need to go on live or none. I don't think he should. Of course, if he go on live, it's going to break the internet. You know what I'm saying? And he's going to get a lot of views and he's going to get paid off it. So that's the smart move to do. You know what I'm saying? Because you always want to make some bread, of course. But as far as like to, to just to explain it, you know, it's been too long at this point. So I don't feel like he need to go online to explain it. You know what I'm saying? Only to make the money, honestly. So, I mean, y'all tell me what y'all feel about it. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm just seeing it. I know I be wild late on stuff. But I just wanted to get my opinion on it. And that's pretty much it. I want to see how y'all feel. Y'all let me know if y'all think I'm bugging. I don't feel like I'm bugging. But y'all let me know if y'all think I'm bugging. Or if y'all agree. All right? Slick to God. I'm out of here.